Hello and welcome back. So in the previous video, we learned how we can attach a security group to our AWS instance and we launched an instance with security group that were entry to HTTPS, HTTP and SSH port 22, but we didn't attach any key pair to our instance. So in this video, we are going to learn how we can create a key pair and attach it to our instance. So there are two methods to attach a key pair to our instance in Terraform. The first is to create a key pair in the AWS console and attaching it to instance from Terraform or directly creating a key pair in Terraform. So first let's create a key pair. I'm going to click on create key pair here and I'm going to name it demo. So the key pair algorithm is going to be RSA format is going to be .pem tags name equal to demo. So I'm going to create a key pair and I'll download it in my home directory. So it will be downloaded here. So I have a key pair that is created in my console. And to use it in the Terraform code, I am going to use an argument that is named as key underscore name is equal to name of the key pair that was demo. So that's it. Save it and I run Terraform plan here. I'm going to see that this key pair is going to be attached to my sense that is going to be created. Search for demo. As you can see, the key name is going to be demo. Run Terraform apply hyphen auto hyphen approve. So after that, I can use this key pair demo to SSH into my AWS instance. For SSH command, you need key pair username and you need public IP of the instance. So once this is created, I'm going to take the public IP of this instance. So this is the key pair that I'm going to use to SSH into my instance. Instance is here, it is in pending state. So this is the key public IP address. Command is SSH EC2 hyphen user. This is the username Add public IP hyphen I and the name of the key. So that is demo.pem. So the resource is now created and enter I should be in my instance. So it is asking, are you sure? I'm going to say yes. Most of the time due to permissions, you can get an error like this. So you might get an error saying warning unprotected file. So what you have to do is just change the permissions. So chmod 400 and the name that is going to be demo.pem. So after this, if I try the SSH command again, I'm going to be in my instance. As you can see, I'm in my instance. It's EC2 hyphen user, the IP address. So this was the first way to create or to attach a key pair in your instance through Terraform. The second way is going to be creating the key pair itself in the Terraform code. So let's comment this out and try the second way. So to create a key pair, let's jump to the Terraform official documentation, AWS key pair resource. Scroll down and this is the snippet that I want. Paste it in my code. It says resource AWS key pair and the name we want is going to be Terraform underscore key. Same name here as well, Terraform underscore key and it is asking for public key but we don't have any public key right so I'm going to remove all of this here right public underscore key and how are we going to get the key so when you create a SSH key you get private and a public key so private key is to be downloaded in your local machine and public key is to be shared on the server so how we are going to create a private key let's search so SSH key Terraform and this is the same documentation scroll down I get this documentation by Terraform that is TLS private key and this is what we are going to use scroll down so there are different algorithms like RSA ED2 5519 like we saw in the key pair section when we created a key pair I can see the same algorithm here as well so I'm going to select this one RSA 4096 bit and paste it here so after this creation I'm going to get public and a private key the public key is going to be stored here so let's just change the name for reference so the name is going to be RSA and to get the public key from this, I'm going to refer this as TLS dot TLS private key dot RSA dot public underscore key underscore open SSH. So it should be public underscore key underscore open SSH. So this is how you are going to get the public key in here. But we also want private key to be stored in our machine so that so that we can SSH into our instance. So to store private key or in our machine, we need to create a file or a folder, right? So how we can create a file to create a file, we have to use Terraform resource that is local. So create file in Terraform. Let's search for it. I get this local file resource and we're going to use this local file resource. Use this resource local file. I'm going to paste it here. Local file name is going to be same TF underscore key and the content should be private content of the key that is going to be created the same like this I'm going to copy this here and paste it here so no need to insert exclamation marks so it should be TLS underscore private key dot RSA dot private underscore key underscore pem 
so this is how you store the private key and the file name should be tf key right so now i have key pair created the public key is going to be stored in my, my aws like this the public key is going to be stored like this here and the private is going to be stored in my machine so let's terraform plan this to see what is going to be created local file with that is going to store private key aws key pair that is going to create a key pair and attach it to our instance and the public key as well so let's run terraform apply again terraform apply so i have commented the first key i have to use this key pair as well so now it is it is created if we can see here if we refresh this have the name of the key as tf dot underscore key right so the same way if i use the name here tf underscore key if you can see here as well i have got the key that stores the private key this is in my local so if i go in my terminal and i go to cd terraform tutorial and i do ls i can see this key tf dot key right so i can use this tf key to ssh into my instance so i go to my instance and i'm copy the public ip of the instance that is going to be created run ssh command ssh ec2 hyphen user at the rate public ip hyphen i and tf key name of the key and it says are you sure i am saying yes permanently added and it's going to show the same error so similarly we are going to run the same command that is chmod 400 and name of the key that is tf key and i'm going to run the ssh command again so now we should be inside our ec2 instance so yes we are inside our ec2 instance so this this is how you create your key pair in the instance the first is directly pasting the name of the key pair in the code in the terraform code and the second way is to create the terraform code so if i run terraform destroy the key is going to be destroyed as well let's just exit it should also destroy this tf dot key so if i do ls now i should see that this tf dot key is gone tf key is gone because it has been deleted and similarly if i go to my key pair here in key pair i also should see that the key tf key has gone because it is going to be applied and deleted according to the resources so this is how you create your key pair in terraform and attach it to your instance so i hope you got the idea and you understood this video so please like this video and subscribe to this channel and have a good day